Hey, sports fans, welcome to this week's edition of the Tahoe Sports Line. I'm joined this week with Bob Morrell and Lauren Sims. Guys, thank you for taking time to join us. Thanks, Thanks for having us. Bob, you want to see an NFL football game? The Tavern's the place to be. Yeah, it is a great spot to be. Niner fans are out in full force as long as they're alive. Get there early because seats are hard to come by. Bloody Marys are absolutely fantastic. Any game you want to watch, I don't care what sport it is, 90% sure we've got it on. And Lauren, you've been behind the scenes all season long administering our Facebook competition. How did our uh, you know, participants do last week? Well, they did awesome. We had three winners, Alan Johnson, Devin Hodges, and Casey Blake, all get a 3-1 record last week, so congratulations to them. They've got some prizes to pick up here at the studio waiting for them. All right. Bob, so without Craig here, and you know he, he won his one you know one time all, all year. Took another week off. Uh, took another week <laughs> off. Uh, we're going to rely on you to help us handicap the games for this upcoming uh, playoff weekend. All right, first off, we start Saturday. New Orleans Saints going into San Francisco, take on the 49ers. Saints are minus three and a half points in this one. They average 14 points less on the road than they do at home. That tells me this will be a tight game. I'm going to take the Niners to cover the spread here. Plus Woo! three and a half. Yes, I agree with you on that one. It's their best year in decades, and I'm just confident that they're going to sweep them this time. And, Bob, I give you credit. Uh, I think you've bet against the Niners all year long and finally you're going with a home team. And guess what? I'm going to roll you. Uh, I, I'm going to throw you a curveball, and I'm going to go against the Niners this week. Uh, I think Drew B Brees breaking that 27-year-old passing record. Offense is on fire. Three points is not a lot of points. I'm going to go with the Saints. All right, we'll see how we do there. Second game, Broncos back east at New England Patriots. They just played three weeks ago. I don't see where a whole lot's changed there. Tebow did come up with a big game last week, played fantastic. But scoring 40 points to beat New England, I don't see it happening. Lay the 13 and a half with New England. This is another blowout. I just have one thing to say. Tebow, Tebow, Tebow. All right, you guys, I, I, I'm going to... I'm going to side with Lauren on this one. I, I hope I'm wrong, but 13 and a half points in any NFL contest is a lot of points. I'm going to officially say the Patriots, I think they're going to win, but the Broncos are going to uh, keep this one close. All right, a lot of points for a playoff game. Go to Sunday now, Houston Texans at Baltimore. These teams played early in the year, but Wade Phillips really is dialed in the Texans' defense. Rookie quarterback or not, Aaron Foster running the ball. I think the Texans keep this game close. I'm going to play them plus a touchdown and a half point. I don't know. I like the Ravens on this one. They've got a strong defense team. I like Joe. So I'm going to root for the Ravens on this one. Yeah, Lauren, I'm going to go against you on this one. I'm oh. Gonna, I'm going to go with Bob on this one. You know, the, the Ravens, they got a great defense, but their offense really isn't that good. And this Texas team with Wade Phillips has got an unbelievable defense. Uh, so I'm going to go with the Texans on this one and take the points. Tough. All right. Another rematch from just a few weeks back. New York Giants into Green Bay. All of a sudden, the Giants' defense is playing red hot. Another point spread over a touchdown. I'm going to take the Giants plus eight and a half points. Boo. Boo. Packers all the way. They're unstoppable. They're amazing. I'm siding with Aaron Rodgers on this one. Yeah, Lauren, I'm with you. I'm going to bet with my heart on this one, and I hate the Giants, so go Pack. All right, folks, don't forget Lake Tahoe TV Facebook. Get your picks in. There's some great prizes out there to be won. That'll do it for this week's edition of the Tahoe Sports Line. We'll see you next week.